State game ended 0 to 0 and not because of bad plays, but simply because of bad weather. For the first time in almost 100 years, LSU canceled a home football game in Tiger Stadium. The last time LSU canceled a home game was in 1918, and that was due to World War I. All new this morning, WDSU sports anchor Fletcher Mackle joins us from the state capitol on why the decision was made to cancel. Good Sunday morning, everyone. I'm Fletcher Mackle, and it was a crazy night here in Baton Rouge on Saturday evening. The LSU Tigers started the 2015 football season against McNeese State University from Lake Charles. But five minutes in eight plays into the game, a rain delay. Because of lightning in the area, they waited over three and a half hours, and then at about 10:45 last night, the game was officially canceled. It boiled down to player safety. Um, at the end of the day. We have to be concerned about the players' welfare. And um, talking to our doctors and our trainers, we felt like um, we would need a full warm up to start again. I mean, I'm talking about a 30 minute warm up. Um, we just felt that it was not in the best interest of our players to, uh, to play this game. And uh, I apologize, but we can't control the weather, and I'm sorry. To the fans, thanks for coming. Thanks for being a part. We. Uh, we tried. We gave everything we, every consideration we could to being on the field and playing that game. Um, I, I, I felt for our opponent um, in, an, in, a, in an away locker room and with a drive in front of them, and you know, in my my opinion, was probably a a, uh, a, a wise decision for both teams. McNeese State and LSU talked about trying to play the game today or even on Labor Day. They said that wasn't possible. Also, the two teams don't have the same bye week, so playing later in the season was also not possible. So, again, the game was canceled and it will not be replayed. LSU is now on to Mississippi State, a huge conference opener in Starkville next Saturday night. For now, though, on your side in Baton Rouge, Fletcher Mackle, WDSU News. And LSU Athletic Director Joe Oliva says while no concrete plans are in place, the university is exploring ways to refund fans for Saturday's cancellation.